ladies and gentlemen, your highness. I'd now like to call forward the general manager of Grand World, Mr. Jamal Abki, who will give a short speech. Your Highness, Sheikh Ahmed bin Saeed Al Maktoum, distinguished guests, fellow employees, ladies and gentlemen, we gather today to celebrate the inauguration of a world class facility. A facility that is purpose built to allow Grand World to meet the growing worldwide demand for shipbuilding and ship repair that serves the offshore, oil and gas, trade, and naval security segments. My friends, when the decision to relocate from Jeddah was made, we had several available options. Some of these options had attractive advantages, but after deep study, we decided that Dubai Maritime City was the unmatched, with its unmatched infrastructure, is the right place for Grand World. Dubai Maritime City has clear and easy access to the Gulf waters. At the same time, it is in the middle of the very dynamic city of Dubai. A unique worldwide marine and business hub. Ladies and gentlemen, on October 18th, we will relocate our offices and major operation to this new facility. And I take this opportunity to assure everybody that we will put this new facility to its best use. Our new headquarters at DMC stretches over 50,000 square meters of land with the state-of-the-art infrastructure. This ultimately transforms to increase our capability to provide more value to our clients. Additionally, our new facility has been designed and constructed as a green construction and eco-friendly facility. Finally, I thank our customers for their unshaken trust and confidence over the past 30 years. I also thank our shareholders, Abraj Capital and Waha Capital, for supporting us to improve and grow in a way that benefits our clients and our employees. I must also thank my colleagues at Grand World who through their hard work and dedication established Grand World as the leading shipyard. Thank you all for joining us to celebrate this momentous occasion. I'd now like to call to the uh, stage the Chairman of Dry Docks, Mr. Kamis Huma. Your Highness, distinguished guest, I think it is lunchtime, but I'll say a few words for the occasion. In early 2011, we decided that we will have a new vision for DMC. We started working very closely with our anchor partners to ensure that we start on the right foot. No doubt, nothing easy as you would imagine. Jamal knows very well the time we spent arguing over issues and trying to help each other in certain issues that unfortunately out of our control. But nevertheless, teamwork, the effort of everybody who I've seen and met and discussed these uh, matters with Grand World, it's been proven to be rewarding and without us, without a doubt, a very successful project. In today's environment, as we always say, tomorrow is more important than today. The truth is, developing this kind of master mega project in here in, the, in DMC is not only a, a statement of DMC potential success, but a statement of a fact that we have now 
fully engaged into promoting DMC as an industrial hub and no doubt as a commercial hub. But nevertheless, the commitment that I've seen from many of our partners has been immense. There is many projects you will see coming up. We are opening one or two before year end, and accordingly, we continue to strive to increase our productivity and efficiency in this important city. With that, I congratulate Grand World for their success, achievement, and no doubt this important and exceptional building that we have here, and without a doubt, the manufacturing pay. Thank you all very much, and congratulations. Thank you. deep appreciation to him for the effort he made and for all the time he spent here struggling and uh, challenging the contractors and the consultants, Diwa, Du and everybody else to make this building as you can see it today. Thank you very much. Sir. I also would like to thank uh, the second man in command who was uh, behind this project. Thank you very much.